foolish hero. Your pursuit ends here, for you will be devoured by the killer monsters of this ravine. <laughs> monsters are chickens a chicken yes I thought it was time to put in something cute but also to make us think about our relationship with food and that bloody hell Ben you <sighs> wait let me fix it there this is no ordinary chicken it's a fire breathing demon chicken Feel bad for them. I always root for the under or under chicken, as it were. I thought the hero was gone for that time. That was just gross. So the mighty hero triumphed over the fire-breathing demonic, um, chickens of doom. Anyway, on she ran, seeking a way out of these dark and gloomy caverns. The hero emerged into the light to find the evil baron at bay. Help me, hero. You're my only hope. I, the Baron, shall tolerate your meddling no longer. My elite hop guard will take care of you. They hunger for human flesh. <laughs> <laughs> I should have paid for better elite guards. elite guards lay at the hero's feet. Nothing now lay between her and the evil Baron. I challenge you to personal combat, hero. But know that I am immune to all weapons save one. A magic sword 
That is the bane of my existence, which there is no way you could possibly have. The sword! The bane sword! It cannot be! No! I am slain! <laughs> What kind of rubbish game lets you kill the villain in one blow? Well, you gave the hero that Baron's Bane sword. Yeah, but it wasn't supposed to be so easy to get. Oh, give it a rest, will you, please? Come on, back to the game. Hero, thank you for saving me. How can I ever repay you? I can think of something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the hero kisses the princess. Two girls kissing. Bit of a cliché. An incredibly hot cliché. It's ironic. It's a self-aware commentary on the nature of the cliché. <sighs> well, an incredibly hot self-aware commentary on the nature of the cliché. And they both lived happily ever after? Well, they would have, but the Baron had poisoned the princess and she died an excruciating death. Her inhuman death shrieks tormented a local stable boy who grew up to be a vicious serial killer. And cannibal. You're sick, Jim. Why do you always want to kill everything? Why can't we just have a happy ending? That is a happy ending. I'm with Ben. They both lived happily ever after and there was little to no cannibalism. Oh, great. Yeah, I've never seen that before. Great work, my friend. You are fantastic! You have to be the best hero of all time. I'm going to have my bard stroke sorcerer compose a song about you. <laughs> Whatever. We bestow upon you the title of Honorary Master of Dungeons! Well, that went well, don't you think? Uh-huh. Good bit of gaming, that. When's the next session? Same time next week. Hang on, where's the orb? Which orb? Which orb? How many orbs have we got? The orb of interplanar transference. I think that Hero kept it. Oh. Hey, probably just as well. For a magical artefact of unfathomable powers...